Just prior to Interop 2007, I get a call from a storage vendor by the name of IOSAFE, who says they have a, a NAS device that's fireproof, waterproof up to 30 foot of salt water, and, and shockproof up to a 30 foot drop or three story building. And I said, fine, let's take a look at it. So to give us a, a good idea of what it could really do, they took us out into the middle of the desert, a few journalists and I, and, and we wrote some data that couldn't be faked onto the device itself and lit that baby on fire. Here you can see it's burning at about 1,700 degrees, and we let it cook for 10 minutes, uh, even though they've tested it in this same kind of condition for up to an hour. Uh, you can see that the uh, person passing in front of there couldn't get any closer than, say, 15 feet without singeing their eyebrows. Anyway, as uh, we turned on the heat, you can see this is after 10 minutes. Uh, the device, the external paint and all the electronics are pretty well cooked, uh, along with the, uh, there's a fry pan on top that we put a, a regular old hard disk in just to see what happened. You can see it spouting flames. It melted into a little silver puddle of aluminum. Then we cooled the baby down in uh, using a garden hose, pulled the disks out after they had cooled a little further, and plugged it into a, a recovery storage array and read the disks as if nothing had happened. It was a <laughs> pretty good demo. Anything that combines fire and damage is cool by me. Steve Hill, Network Computing Magazine. This